The firefly is equipped with an amazing system. This insect has an organ in its body that produces fluorescent light. This light has great significance for the firefly to preserve its race. Because the female and male fireflies recognize each other by looking at their lights. The fluorescent organ of the firefly is composed of three layers, just like the headlamps of an automobile. Cells that produce light lie at the bottom layer. The duty of these cells is to produce a combustible substance. This combustible substance reacts with oxygen controlled by an enzyme. As a result of this chemical reaction, the fluorescent light manufactured in a similar fashion to a factory is first transferred to the adjacent concave layer and then to the upper transparent layer where it is reflected as light. The perfect quality and 98% productivity rate of this fluorescent light astonished scientists examining fireflies. The light bulbs used for lighting purposes by people can only convert 5% of the received energy into light, the remaining 95% being lost in the form of heat. Because of this 95% heat which is released, we cannot touch a light bulb when it is on. Despite the fact that the firefly produces almost 20 times more light than a light bulb, the temperature does not rise due to the cold nature of its light. Man can produce cold light only in laboratories at the end of a series of chemical reactions, it is obviously irrational to claim that this complex lighting system has been designed and then installed in the body of this tiny insect by itself. More irrational than this is the claim of the theory of evolution that this system formed as a result of coincidences in nature. The perfection in the firefly's body is an indication that it is the product of a superior wisdom and infinite knowledge. God created all living species with distinct qualities and through them shows us his eternal might. In a verse of the Quran, people are summoned to ponder on this fact. Among his signs is the creation of the heavens and earth and all the creatures he has spread about in them and he has the power to gather them together whenever he wills.